Michael Kenny after setting the standard for the last 10 years in hurling and it was nice to kind of get up to that. We know we have a good bit to go yet to, to be up with them. Like they have a few injuries on the day and we had a couple of injuries as well. So it's good preparation all right, for the championship but at the end of the day, that's the league and that's, it's a diff, completely different competition. It's gone now, it's in the past. You have to look on the victories you had and you know, and, you know, instill a bit of confidence. There's a few new lads that have come into the panel this year and they're after adding a whole new confidence level to the team as well. The younger lads like Noel McGrath, they're great performance in the league, only 18 years old. So, I mean, the older lads have to kind of look at that and go, well, if he's doing it, you know, we should be stepping up to the plate as well. And it's great to hear everyone in the panel is talking and everyone is getting on well with each other and just everyone's really looking forward to the year ahead. Like, just looking at the cup there, right, to kind of nearly put the shivers down your back, like, to, you're so close to it yet so far. I mean, I suppose Kilkenny wise are probably bringing the cup up to these kind of events for the last few years, so it'd be nice to it'd be nice to bring it up, you know, and it'd be nice to have it, have it around home again. But um, you know, does it, we're a long, long way from that. Coming from a small place to a small parish like Ballin Hinch, it's great for the older people to go to the matches and kind of have someone to relate to. Or you know, a lot of people call over to the house there if the mother or father were there and they just ask them how Shane got on a train. And it's great for them, I suppose. They don't have to go into Nina or the Tommy Varas and see how things are going, and that they have that to relate to. So you know, it means a lot to them when you you come home and you see how much it means to, to those people and to the younger people around. Four years ago there now against Limerick, it was in the Thurless, um, I suppose the outstanding memory that day would be Owen, Owen scored I think 13 or 14 points and you know gave one of the greatest exhibitions ever in Championship Hurling and I just uh, I just remember being nervous alright you know putting on the jersey but as soon as I got the first ball then as any, any of the lads would say you know you just the nerves go and you just you tune out and I really really enjoyed that game and you know we were lucky enough to get a victory that day. We all hurling, I suppose. Uh, the running kind of comes into it as well. I suppose the nights were not training. I, you know, I just go down to the alley or do some, something on my own. The thing with midfield is, as any midfielder would tell you, that yeah, you're not really in any fixed position. You're, you have to be kind of corner forward and corner back, kind of at the same time, up and down the field, and kind of have to make make the breaks for the backs and put the ball into the boys as well. So it's a hard position to play. You can break for you some days, some days it won't. But uh, you know, you have to be fairly fit to play there, right?